Hello everyone, welcome to the Taekwondo matches at the 2019 Chungju World Martial Arts Masterships. I'm Ki Kim. Taekwondo is a Korean traditional martial arts. Taekwondo is a combative sport and its tradition has been preserved over time. It was developed over the years and has been an Olympic event since 2000. We have the Pumse and the Kyorugi in Taekwondo. Pumse is known as form and refers to the technical skills used in attacks and defense. Kyorugi is sparring and it refers to a confrontation with another opponent. The Pumse and Team Kyorugi matches are held at the Chungju World Martial Arts Masterships. The first match for the Team Kyorugi Mixed Semi-Final is held. Blue is Russia and red is Chinese Taipei. The two players are testing each other and both of them are waiting to tackle one another. The Chinese Taipei scores first. The match becomes even more heated. And the Russian athlete also scores and it's now 2-2. Two and two. Team Russia loses a point while Team Chinese Taipei advances. The Russian athlete counterattacks and advances 2-5 to 2. Two. Both players try to attack each other right from the beginning. The current score is 5 to 6 and the Chinese Taipei athletes advancing and the Russian athletes advances and it's a tie. The two players succeed in attacking each other and the Russian athletes advance by 9 to 7. Both athletes succeed the attacks and the score is now 11 to 10. The player loses a point and it's a tie at 11 to 11. The players take turns in the team Kyorugi matches. The rotation of players is a form of a strategy. only have 30 seconds left on the third round. It's a tight match between the two teams, and the Russian team moves fourth after successful attack. <laughs> 20 seconds are left, and both teams are busy changing the players. Only five seconds left, and both teams do their best. The final score is 13 to 12. The second match for the Team Kyorugi Mixed Semi Final has begun. Team Morocco is blue, and Team Iran is red. The Iranian player is a promising contender for this match. The players begin to test each other's skills first. The Iranian athlete succeeds in attack and scores first. Oh, the Iranian player falls and loses a point. The current score is 1-2. to two. The Moroccan player succeeds in winning a point and it's a tie. Ah! 
This time, Team Iran scores a point. The player succeeds in consecutive attacks, and the score is now 2-4. to four. The Moroccan player continues to attack, and it's a tie again. Both players are in a fierce attack mode. The Iranian player falls and Team Morocco catches up with a score at 5-6. The Moroccan player ties the match in the third round. <laughs> Team Morocco moves fourth as it continuously scores. On top of everything, a warning is issued and the score is now 9-6. to six. <laughs> Team Iran begins to counterattack. Both teams begin a fierce attack. Team Iran scores, and it's 9 to 8. The Iranian athlete delivers a powerful punch, and the score is now 9 to 9. Morocco scores a three-pointer attack and moves fourth in the match. There's only one minute left in the third round. Players from both teams grit their teeth and do their best. Team Iran scores with a punch and catches up right behind Team Morocco. The two athletes continue attacking one another. Both teams change the players and take a breather. Time continues to go by. Both teams change players with less than 30 seconds to go. Both players simultaneously attack and Team Iran scores. It is a tie 12 to 12. There's only 20 seconds left and one point can finish the match. The match ends with no points and the players are changed once again. Will a team win in this round? Both players are engaged in a fierce battle. The third round ends and it's now time for the golden round. <laughs> Team Iran scores as soon as the golden round begins. Team Iran scores again. Final score is 13 to 16 and Team Iran enters the finals. Next up, we have the Taekwondo Freestyle Pumse Pair Mixed Final. The Russian athletes begin the performance. The Pumse in Taekwondo refers to attack and defense. Freestyle Pumse is a training where the attack and defense skills are shown in a freestyle manner. Let's continue checking out the Freestyle Pumse performance of the Russian athletes.
Team Russia finished the performance with a jaw-dropping jump in the air. Next up, we have the athletes from the Philippines. An extravagant jump in the air. Freestyle Pumse uses music to show freestyle choreography using Taekwondo moves. It's like watching a figure skating at the Winter Games. Precise skills and creativity are important in this event. Team Philippines gave their all into the performance. Up next, we have the athletes from Vietnam. You're watching the freestyle Pumse paired mixed. The chemistry with one's partner is important in this event. Let us now see the superb rapport of the two athletes. Just a fantastic performance by Team Vietnam. Next up, we have our very own Team Korea. Athlete Kwa won is the one who made a declaration as an athlete representative at the opening ceremony of the Chungju World Martial Arts Masterships. South Korea is the suzerain state of Taekwondo, so can the two athletes live up to everyone's expectations? They show an excellent rapport and they show accurate moves according to the music. just checked out the flawless performance by Team Korea. The final participants are Team Thailand. Athletes from Thailand gave their all and showed everything they had rehearsed at the Chungju World Martial Arts Masterships.
Team Thailand also showed a flawless performance. And today's highlight is Team Kyoruki mixed final. Team Russia is blue and Team Iran is red. The match begins. The players from both teams cautiously make their move. Iranian athlete scores first. <laughs> Team Iran scores again, and the current score is 0 to 3. Iran scores again, and there's a score gap between the two teams. The Iranian athletes are dominating the game with their sharp and fast attacks. Six points, seven points. Team Russia can't score just yet. It's going to be a tough game if they continue yielding to Team Iran. Team Russia makes a mistake and gives another point to Team Iran. The Iranian athlete succeeds in making another attack, and the score is now 0 to 9. Team Iran seems a bit more laid back now. They've acquired 9 points in the first round. Team Russia is getting a bit agitated as all of their attacks fail almost every time. First round ends with Team Iran leading by nine points. The second round of games begins. We have the female athletes from both teams taking center stage. <laughs> Team Iran continues to score. Finally, Team Russia scores. It's 2 to 11. But the Iranian athletes continue to score non stop. Team Iran changes its players and they seem a bit more relaxed. There's too big a gap between the two teams, but Team Russia isn't ready to give up just yet. Both athletes are fiercely attacking each other. Team Iran leads the match at 4-18. Team Russia gives another score to Team Iran because of a warning. Now the score is 4 to 19. There's 10 seconds left in the second round, and Team Russia scores two more points. There's only a few seconds left, but both teams change its players once again. The second round has come to an end. The 
third round of the matches begins. The current score is 6-19 and Team Iran is leading the games. Can Team Russia nail the pretty big gap? Team Russia scores an extra two more points, and the current score is 8 to 19. Team Iran succeeds in scoring another point as soon as they change players. The current score is 8 to 20. The athletes attack each other, and the current score sits at 9 to 21. There's a huge score gap, but the team Russia doesn't give up just yet. <laughs> team Iran scores an additional two more points. Iranian athletes succeed in additional attacks and the score is now 10-25. Team Russia slowly catches up with only a minute left until the match ends. Both teams change players and they attack each other with intense kicks. <laughs> Team Iran scores another point. Team Russia is determined to score another point before the match ends. There's only about 40 seconds left in the match and both teams change players. <laughs> Team Russia succeeds in scoring another point. We must apply their taekwondo mindset and attitude for never giving up until the end, even though they have a slim chance of winning. Team Russia waits to make another attack. There's only 10 seconds left and the last set of players enter the match. Both teams give their all and concentrate on the game regardless of who wins or loses. Final score is 14 to 26, and Team Iran wins the Team Kyorugi mixed final. We applaud Team Russia for coming in second place. We hope you enjoyed the Taekwondo matches of the 2019 Chungju World Martial Arts Masterships. This has been Ki Kim, and thank you so much for tuning in.